engineering, building artificial coral reefs. Earth's coral reefs are critical for the stability of marine ecosystems. Unfortunately, many are classified as threatened because of the effects of human activity. Living corals depend on the limestone deposited by their predecessors to get the minerals necessary to build their own bodies. However, the limestone is being dissolved from existing reefs due to increased ocean acidity caused by climate change. Marine ecologists are now combating this destruction by sinking artificial reefs, such as the one shown in Figure 16, which uses an electric current to attract the limestone deposits needed by growing coral. Factors that affect biodiversity. Many factors can reduce biodiversity. Human activities can reduce it very quickly. Humans need food, and much of that food comes from crop plants. Large areas of land must be cleared to make fields to grow crops. Developing agricultural land removes most of the native plant and animal species in a region and replaces them with few species that are managed as crops. In addition, pesticide use can negatively affect any na remaining native organisms. Biodiversity is also lost when land is cleared for human housing or, and industrial sites. Introduction of new plants and animals into ecosystems is another serious issue. These species can reduce biodiversity by preying on native species or outcompeting native species for resources, such as food or, or shelter. Keystone species. Sometimes a single species has an especially strong effect on an entire ecosystem. This species is called a keystone species. Whatever happens to this species affects the affects all the other species in, in that ecosystem. For example, when beavers build a dam across a stream, it turns a terrestrial ecosystem into a freshwater ecosystem. This kills existing plants and forces land animals to move to new territories. The pond's inhabitants rely on the beavers to maintain the dam. If the beavers are removed, the dam will eventually fall. The pond will drain and over time the land will return, return to a extraterrestrial ecosystem, such as a meadow.